Let's face it, it's a way of life. Each and every year it happens so quickly and unprepared that you'll be surprised and trapped and literally have no way to go. I'm talking about cars that wade through flood. If you are living in a tropical country and used to flooding every year. Listen to this. Anyone who has ever driven through floodwaters understands how terrifying the experience can be. Those who have driven a manual car across a flooded road will recall how difficult it was to maintain throttle balance in second gear while avoiding water entering the exhaust pipe. Those who have driven earlier automatic automobiles may recall how careful they had to be to prevent getting water on the computer box. A car could stall if a driver makes a mistake while wading through water. In a flood, stalling is a recipe for disaster. There's a lot of trouble. Vehicles trapped in the midst of flooded streets have been seen in China following recent rainfall. Such scenes are not unusual in the country, or in any other Asian country for that matter. Cars stranded due to floodwaters are not uncommon in areas that are hit by dozens of hurricanes or typhoons each year. What's new is witnessing a new breed of automobiles capable of navigating treacherous waters without stalling. What's even more incredible is that these aren't enormous, customized SUVs with snorkels and all-terrain tires. They're sleek Tesla Model 3 sedans, low to the earth, loaded with technology, and proudly electric. The short film was stunning, especially because the car appeared to be incredibly cool as it aggressively speeding the flooded street. Then stopping immediately because regenerative braking and actual braking doesn't work efficiently due to the water on those brake pads and calipers. Later reporting on the tragedy revealed the clip's terrible history. According to local accounts, the Model 3 in the video was exiting a flooded tunnel where several vehicles were already trapped. This indicated that the driver was most likely terrified and pushed the Model 3 through the water when it started floating. The Model 3 battery pack, which are pretty much sealed all the way round. Take note of the orange-colored wires which are high voltages, safe when unplugged from the battery pack. But when electrified, can shock anyone near it if conducted with water. Motor, inverter, charger module, rapid splitter, HV interlock circuit, the high power distribution module or HBDM in the front junction block, electric air conditioning compressor, pyrotechnic fuse, cabin and battery pack are sealed including these critical components because of high voltage of around 400 volts. A couple of components inside the cabin below the rear bottom seat that were also pretty much sealed by using thick grommets on wires and cables to pipe through the rear firewall. So if you are in a country that usually floods, look for a car that has less holes in the cabin. The only car I can think of that was similar to Tesla car with less hole was a Beetle. The reason Schwimmwagen was invented using, similar to VW Beetle is VW bus under chassis and power plant. With a few modifications and extra sealing, it can float through water. I'll discuss on my next video why this Tesla is so sealed that it can float and why I compare the cabin to a VW Beetle. I'd like to ask you to do is go down below and click the subscribe button and click on the bell icon on this video and give it a thumbs up or thumbs down, or whatever. Both helps my channel grow. I do videos about anything and everything under the sun every single week. This again is Sea Saints.